Hi, I'm here with Catherine Cobden, Executive Vice President, Forest Products Association of Canada. And Catherine, you've been you've joined us all day today at the Fiber Conference, so thank you very much. It's been great. Thank you. And recently, uh, FPAC has rolled out a, a new vision. Can you tell us about Vision 2020? Vision 2020 is um, um, an exciting uh, articulation of the future of the Canadian forest industry. Um, as you may know, we've been through some fairly tough times, but we've turned a corner and we felt it was important to um, document and explain uh, what the future of the industry looks like now that we've sort of retooled, reshaped, and regrouped, um, and we're extremely well positioned. So Vision 2020 is really um, has three inspirational goals that the members of the Forest Products Association of Canada, who are the producers of lumber, pulp, and paper, et cetera, in, in across the country, um, they've, they've really identified three areas that they, in the next eight years, they want to achieve, and they're truly remarkable goals. So for example, um, we are a $54 billion industry right now, and the industry aspires to be uh, to add an additional twenty billion dollars to our economic activity. And how we see that we want, how we sort of see we're going to do this, and where we have the confidence to suggest this goal, is in terms of the innovation that's coming out of the innovation system and the development of new markets. Uh, we have been aggressively pursuing. Um, we really see that this is within our reach as a sector mm -hmm. to, uh, to achieve that. But in order to facilitate that, and that's why I uh, took the time to be here today, because uh, we do need to leverage the innovation and research and development that's coming out of the broad innovation system uh, from the research, uh, from the university community, as well as from FP Innovations. And what about talent and the training of talent that Fiber is doing? Absolutely. Well, so a second goal of Vision 2020 um, is to uh, add an additional um, 60,000 new uh, recruits into the forest industry. So if you can imagine, we've had some job loss in the industry over the last decade. And so um, our goal now is to rebuild and 60,000 is a conservative estimate. And that includes uh, skill trades, uh, uh, foresters, uh, um, a whole variety of, a whole spectrum of, of options. But it also includes scientists and engineers and, uh, you know, key, yeah, highly skilled and qualified. And that's, again, another reason for being here today. There are four, over 400 students from universities across the country that are plugged in uh, to this fiber network. And we want to plug in with them with respect to the vision of the industry. And FPAC has recently launched, launched a portal for its students. Can oh. you describe that? Yes, absolutely. So in order to facilitate this and, and recognizing that 60,000 uh, new people coming into the industry in short, eight short years, mm -hmm. it's a pretty dramatic increase. Um, so to facilitate that and to particularly to reach out to students, we have created a single portal, a, we a website mm -hmm. um, that should give students everything they need to know about the industry. It's called thegreenestworkforce.ca and um, it's a terrific tool, I think, for understanding what kind of wages could you expect for various jobs in the industry, where one would go to get the training necessary for those, individ for those types of jobs. What level of training is this a, uh, requires a high school degree or a college diploma or a university degree? And it kind of, it's all in one place to try to make um, a student's interest or entree into the industry as simple and as uncomplicated as possible. And it's available and open? Oh, it's available to anyone, in Great. fact. And it's not, it's not only geared to students, but students that we hope will really use it. Uh, but it's geared as well to older workers, Aboriginal people, uh, women in our communities that may be, have an interest in working in the industry. Uh, you know, we're making great progress, but we, we have a long way to go with a goal of 60,000 uh, yes. new recruits. The greenestworkforce.ca. The greenestworkforce.ca. Well, thank you for being a collaborating partner with Fiber and for all of your support. Thank you very much okay. for having me. Thank you. All right.